Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scottalicious McFabulous here. And I'm so glad that you guys could join me today. And today we are going to be talking about the Michael Kors dust bag debacle that is currently going on over in the United States. What? What's going on? Y'all are going to jail! Period! As far as I can tell, this is specifically related to the United States online stores. And before we get into the tea that I got today, if you guys love fashion and handbags, Michael Kors, Coach, all of those goodies, hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy today's content, please leave a like on the video. It helps with the channel and the algorithm. And without further ado, let's get into this because this is kind of messy. Now, before we get into the technical mess, if you guys do not know, Michael Kors for United States has a VIP program that they call Kors VIP. They have an app in the app store for it. I'm jealous. I am jealous. I wish us Canadians had that or, you know, anybody else in the goddamn world, but, you know, America. I fucking hate you, girl. So now why this is such a mess for United States Michael Kors specifically is because they have stopped including dust bags from my knowledge, all together with their bags, which is absolutely shocking to me. I was like, huh? What's the reason? If anybody from the United States has gotten a different response from an, a Michael Kors representative via email, please let me know. I got a screenshot of an email from a very good subscriber of mine. Uh, her name is AC Williams. I really enjoy her. She's so kind. She showed me the email she got via a screenshot stating that uh, there is a shortage in dust bags. I'm going to read off the email for you guys here. Thank you very much for contacting Michael Kors. It's our pleasure to assist. We understand your concern and we apologize for the inconvenience. At this time, dust bags cannot be sent out as we do not have them available. However, they will be in stock and shipped to you within six to seven months. They're telling her she has to wait six to seven months to receive her dust bags in the mail. Now, the gag is, the gag is, when you, anybody in the United States Corps VIP section goes to log in, guess what they are selling for $5 a piece? Yeah, dust bags. <laughs> So whoever emailed back to Miss Williams flat out lied. They lied straight through their teeth. They lied. Whoever sent that email should be immediately inspected by Michael Kors themselves and they should possibly be fired because what was the reason in lying? Has anybody else received a similar email saying they'll get their dust bag in six to seven months, but go on the website and see the fact that they got them on sale for $5? Now, what really upsets me is at first I thought, okay, maybe, just maybe they were putting dust bags up for like a pre-order or like you buy it and then like in six to seven months you'll get it. No. Absolutely not. The same subscriber that had actually got that email also decided to purchase said dust bags and it shipped to her in literally two days. What happened to the six to seven month time frame? There is absolutely no excuse 
other than that employee lied just to save face. Just to save some face. I, I am irritated because no employee there is a really big problem with american companies allowing employees to message customers via email stating a whole bunch of random ass nonsense this is not a michael kors specific issue this is an american company issue i have noticed from many companies and i mean like makeup brands clothing brands literally car dealers like america united states has a massive issue with customer service all companies should be watching like every email an employee sends out on behalf of their company because you can't have employees lying like this. Drag her. Okay. Now, this is me giving some possible leeway on Michael Kors itself for this. Now, because there are so many customer service issues with dust bags, boxes, all of it. Like, literally, there are so many issues. Just go in some reviews and you'll be absolutely flabbergasted with how many people have issues trying to get their dust bag maybe just maybe they decided to sell dust bags by themselves instead of including them with orders to completely avoid these types of customer reactions when they don't get their dust bags because when i tell you some people go absolutely crazy and I mean, like, they will go on every single post Michael Kors makes on all of their social medias. And they'll be like, where is my dust bag? And it's like, holy crap, girl. Like, chill. It is just a dust bag. But I understand why you're upset. I understand what why you are upset. But just deep breath. In through their nose, out through the mouth, everything will be fucking okay. <laughs> One of the main reasons I can see why Michael Kors would be doing this is this is a for sure way you will get your dust bag. And let's say for customers like me, though I'm not in the United States, I am a Canadian customer. So my customer service experience complete 180. I deal with completely. I have never not received a dust bag when I've been told I would. I've never really had issues other than one time where my Soho up here did not come in a box. That was the only thing that happened. But other than that, I've received all of my dust bags. I've never had an issue with dust bags. Like, I have tons of dust bags and I don't even use them all. So there's a possibility there's literally customers that are like, I don't need dust bags. Please stop sending me them. And then there's also customers being like, where the fuck is my dust bag? Give me my dust bag. I deserve it. So I do think this is a possible way to navigate that whole boat of like insanely angry customers this could be just an easy way to be like hey five dollars pay for it you get it and that's it that's all you don't receive it we'll send you a new one that is the only thing other than just money grubbing that's the only thing i can think of is that american customers that's like a for sure way to receive your dust bag if you want one. I would assume some customers don't necessarily need nor want one. It's a very sharp double-aged sword and I... <laughs> I personally think the best way a company, aka <clears throat> Michael Kors, uh, the best way Michael Kors could actually go about doing this is do what Coach does. If you guys watched my Coach unboxing video of my Coach Tabby 26, it actually came in a box wrapped in the dust bag with all of my michael kors bags the dust bag was in the bag no with coach the bag is literally the dust bag is literally over the bag so i think that is the easiest simplest way in order for customers to get their dust bag is don't send it out unless it is wrapped. Do not send it out unless it is wrapped. And in all honesty, if you are able to, please go in 
store in person. Just go to the store in person, make the little half hour trip because you will have a literal night and day difference with customer service experience, at least in my personal humble opinion. I absolutely love going into the Michael Kors that I go to. I love going there. I love going there. The employees are always super sweet. They're always willing to uh, answer my questions and they're very easygoing. And I really do feel like if you didn't get a dust bag, you would be able to just go up to them and be like, hey, I didn't receive a dust bag. Can I please get it? And they would probably just give you one. I, I really feel like the customer service experience in person blows the online experience out of the goddamn water completely. But with all of this being said, I love you guys. And I really appreciate Miss Williams for sending me all this information. It is so helpful. Am I making it on YouTube? Am I making it? I had, a, I had a subscriber give me information for the first time and I feel glorious. I, I was like, damn, this is what it feels like to have fans. Girl, thank you. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to quickly show you guys a stunning outfit of the day. And I am, girl, I'm about to end careers. 99, don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand, or nine nine hundred ninety-nine. There can be a hundred people in the room, in the room, in the room, and ninety-nine, ninety-nine, ninety-nine don't don't believe in you. There can be a hundred people in the room. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's outfit of the day. <gasps> Got some super color combo matching here. Anyways, y'all, I love you. And if you guys are new, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have. Share with your friends and family. And check out the description box for my Instagram link and the Discord notification the Discord notification squad. And I hope to see you all in my next video. I, 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 uh, bye. Uh, I, I think it was good. I, I, I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no, show's <laughs> over. Show's <laughs> over.